the first and the most important all are important terminologies in case of coordination compounds the first one is coordination entity coordination entity so what is this actually what is coordination entity means it is nothing but the metal atom metal atom or ion which bound with or bounded with secondary valence secondary valence so once again secondary valence of any metal atom or ion is satisfied by either neutral species or negative species hence combinedly for example in case of i would like to consider co n h3 taken 6 the coordination entity is like this the metal atom or the metal ion which is connected with or binded with or coordinately binded with secondary valence that means either neutral species or negative species combinedly called as coordination entity and second one metal atom metal atom or ion in coordination entity the atom which readily forms coordination covalent bonds with metal atoms or coordination covalent bonds with some atoms such atoms are called as metal atoms or metal ions in coordination entity the atoms which wants to form coordination covalent bonds coordination covalent bonds with secondary valence that means ligands is known as known as metal atom or ion for example let us consider n i c o taken 4 in this specified example nickel wants to form coordination covalent bond with carbon monoxide ligands that means during the formation of nickel tetracarbonyl complex the four carbonyl molecules are going to donate non-bonding pair of electrons towards the empty orbitals of nickel that means nickel is going to accept electrons by accepting electrons the nickel will exhibit or uh, nickel is going to form coordination covalent bond so this nickel or whatever the atom which is going to form coordination covalent bond with ligands is known as metal atom similarly the third important terminology or terms generally we come across during the coordination compounds ligand ligands so we have to know what are ligands in coordinating coordinating entity the species which can donate which can donate a pair of electrons pair of electrons to bound with metal atom 
or ion is called as ligands so let us have these two conditions here in the above said metal atoms or ion the metal atom is going to accept a pair of electrons from donors hence in this case metal atoms are also called as lewis acids in this case metal atoms are also known as lewis acids whereas ligands they are readily donate non bonding pair of electrons or a pair of electrons to provide or to form coordination covalent bond with metal atom or ion in this case they are also called as lewis bases especially the word satisfied for neutral ligands only again the ligands are two or more types here different types of ligands are possible different types of ligands what are the different types of ligands number 1 unidentate ligand unidentate ligand so what are unidentate ligands so before going to explain unidentate ligand once again the in coordinating entity the species which can donate a pair of electrons to bond with metal atom or ion or to form a coordination covalent bond with metal atom or ion is called as ligand generally the ligands may be neutral species neutral molecules or species or negative ions 